and welcome to your last literacy week in reception oh my goodness i can't believe how fast the time has gone i'd like to finish this week with an extra special treat this week in literacy we're going to go to the aquarium <gasps> how exciting now, as much as I wish I could take you to a real aquarium, you're going to watch one on the video, but it's still going to be very exciting. An aquarium is a tank where lots of different sea creatures live. You can have small aquariums in your house for things like little fish and snails, or big aquariums that you can visit where there are lots of bigger sea creatures like sharks, stingrays and jellyfish. Have you been to an aquarium before? If you have, what did you see? What was your favourite part? If you haven't been to an aquarium, don't worry, you're going to go and see one very soon. Meet Blippi. Blippi is my special friend. Blippi loves going on trips and he wants to show you an aquarium. Let's go and meet Blippi. Blippi. So much to learn about. It'll make you want to shout Blippi. And today we're at Odyssey in Scottsdale, Arizona. Come on! This is gonna be awesome. I think today you and I should learn about some animals. Whoa, look at this place! Oh, those are kind of like raindrops. Hello! <laughs> okay, let's go over here. Ooh, we're almost to the top! Ooh. Yeah, let's go! This is gonna be so much fun! Oh, did you see that? I just used two fingers on the back of the head in the back of this Russian sturgeon. Oh, it looks like he liked it. Whoa, it feels so cool. It's hard, but it also has kind of a layer of a slippery sludge on it. <laughs> it helps keep all the parasites away. Oh, here's another one. That is awesome! <laughs> Whoa, did you see that? I just touched the stingray nice and gently with my two fingers on its back. Whoa, okay, let's, uh, let's touch another one. Oh, here's one right over here. Oh, oh hey! Whoa, <laughs> that's silly! Ooh, come over here. Whoa. There's so many of them. Whoa. Look at that one. It's just resting on the ground. That's a different kind. Huh. Oh, here comes one. Whoa. Hey, I'll describe what it feels like. It kind of feels... Oh, here's one more. Whoa! Yeah, I really know what it feels like now. It feels like a wet gummy bear. <laughs> oh, so slippery and soft at the same time, but firm as well. Wow, <laughs> this is fun. Blippi, what are you doing? Oh, just sitting here looking at my favorite fish, the paddlefish. Ooh, paddlefish? That's pretty cool. It is. Well, see you later. Hope oh, see you later, Blippi. Whoa, this is pretty cool being behind the scenes of the aquarium. Hello. <laughs> this is awesome. Whoa. <laughs> hey. 
so many cool workers here. Whoa, look at this. We're on top of an aquarium. Whoa, look at all that water and those fish down there. Whoa, okay, follow me. Whoa, look at this room. Whoa, there's so much scuba gear in here, tanks, wetsuits. Whoa, okay, we need to take this fish to the sharks. I bet they're really hungry, come on. Whoa! Wow! <laughs> okay! Whoa! Look at this! Whoever drew that is a good artist! It shows the different parts of a shark! Yeah! Like the gills! Whoa! <laughs> Whoa! Look! Alright! We did it! Here you go! Hi! Thank you! Yeah. You're welcome! What's your name? My name's Danny. Ooh, this is Danny, and what are you doing here? So we're here with Cassie, and she's actually feeding our big sharks right now. Oh, look, I see a fish down there. Look. Whoa, so what? Why is she holding a fish on a pole? So that's how we get the food down to our sharks. It's they're really low in the water column. She needs to be able to have a really long tool to get the food down to their mouth. Okay, so they hold the pole, which has a fish on the end, and then the sharks come up and have some supper. <laughs> Ooh, this looks like fun. Whoa, those fish look big. How big is that fish that she's feeding the sharks? It's about this big. It's called a blue fish because it has a kind of blue tint to it. Okay, that's a blue fish. That's about this big. So what kind of fish did I bring up? You brought up some herring, which is the big fish in here. Okay. And then some caitlin, which is the little fish in here. Okay. Huh. Interesting. Oh. Hey, okay. well, this is pretty cool seeing someone else do it, but hey, can I feed some sharks? Yeah, absolutely. Okay. okay. Just make sure you have your gloves on because the fish can be kind of stinky. <laughs> oh, okay. All right. Let's put the gloves on so then, like, Hands don't smell like fish for weeks. <laughs> okay, all right, I got my gloves on. Uh, oh, there we go. One glove, two gloves. All right, so now what do I do? So we'll just take this fish bucket that you brought up from our kitchen and we'll head over here. Okay, all right. Okay. We'll head over to our feeding platform. Okay. And as soon as we walk up, the fish will be all ready for us. Whoa, look! I'm on the platform. Whoa, look! There's no barriers between me and the fish. Okay, I'm just gonna jump in. Oh, no. <laughs> just kidding. All right, here we go. Can I throw one at a time? Yeah, whatever you want. You can throw one at a time or all of it at once. All right, enjoy this. They're swarming to the top because they know that I'm throwing all this yummy food to them. Here you go, fish. Did that taste me? <laughs> is that tasty, fish? Or is that tasty? <laughs> okay, just a little left. Whoa! That was so much fun! <laughs> Good job! Whoa! Ooh, she's feeding a turtle! Come on! Whoa! So many cool things up here! Whoa! Okay, let's go over here! Whoa! <laughs> Whoa! Hey, what are you doing? I am feeding Greta, our green sea turtle. Ooh, she's feeding Greta? That's a nice name. And this is Greta. Do you see Greta? Hey, Greta. Hey. Ooh, what does Greta like to eat? Greta loves 
lettuce, but she also enjoys cucumbers, bell peppers, and even sometimes carrots. Ooh, lettuce, bell peppers, cucumbers, and carrots? Sounds like Greta's really healthy. <laughs> Can I try feeding Greta? Yeah. Hey, okay. all right. How do I do it? Just a little bit? Yeah, you can a little bit, the whole leaf. You just pop it in front of her. There you go, Greta. Whoa. Hey, what are you doing? It's behind you. Should I throw another? Oh, there you sure. go. Sure, there we go. Sometimes you just have to come eat. Okay. All right. Ooh, Greta's hungry. Here you go, Greta. Yum! Here you go. Oh, Greta is really big. Do you know how much Greta weighs? She is a little bit over a hundred pounds. Oh wow, a hundred pounds. Wow. Oh, here you go. <laughs> okay, let's do a big piece. Let's watch Greta eat a whole piece. Here you go. Oh, it's right there! Yeah! Whoa! Hey! <laughs> Hello! Whoa! That's a big piece of lettuce! Hello! Hey! Hello! <laughs> Come on! Since we just touched some animals, I think we should use this restroom and wash our hands. Let's go! Okay, welcome to the bathroom. Whoa, look! Whoa! Look! This restroom is underwater. And this restroom actually won the best restroom in America. Whoa, you can wash your hands right here and look at shark! Sharks and fish! Whoa! This is awesome! <laughs> Pretty cool. All right, I wash my hands. Now I'll go dry them. You enjoy the view. Okay, let's go down the escalator to the deep ocean. <laughs> Come on. Like we're underwater. Look this way. <laughs> oh, that's awesome. I present to you the deep ocean exhibit. Hello! Hey! So this is a sea lion. Whoa! There's another one over here. Whoa, it's so big! Whoa! <laughs> so cool! Oh, look, look, look! Whoa, hello! <laughs> Whoa! And there's actually a seal in here as well. Let's go try and find it. Oh, let's see. Oh, here it is. Hello. See that right here? This is a seal. Hi. So there's three sea lions in here and one seal. And the easiest way to tell the difference is this. I'll show you. So if you're a sea lion, you use your front flippers to, to basically walk like this. <laughs> but seals don't do that. Seals, oh, hello. Oh, you're curious, huh? <laughs> so curious. 
Whoa. So that's a sea lion. Mm -hmm. So it walks with its flippers. Hello, 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 hello. They're actually really smart animals. See how it's following me? I'll try and change directions. Whoa! <laughs> okay, and seals, they don't walk like that, you know? This is a sea lion. Sea lion. And a seal, they don't have that much power right here, and it's kind of short and stubby. So this is what they do. So they just kind of waddle. That's silly. Wow, what magnificent creatures. Check them out a little bit more. We're behind the scenes at the aquarium, and we're gonna meet some penguins. Come on! Okay, let's walk nice and slow, and we'll be very quiet as well. Ooh, hey, who are you? Hutch. Ooh, this is Hutch. Hey, what do you do here? I work with the penguins and reptiles. Ooh, the penguins and the reptiles. Oh, do you see the penguins back there? Oh, hello! Are these your only two penguins here? Oh no, we have more friends that are coming. Would you like to grab a toy? We're actually going to play with them. Sure! Okay, let's grab a toy and let's see some more penguins. Look over there! Also can see colors really well. They have rods and cones in their eyes, just like we do. Okay. They're kind of, although they're birds, they're kind of acting like kitty cats, huh? Just a little bit. They do like to play with a lot of different types of toys, and just like kitty cats, they tell us when they want to be touched. Okay. Huh. Interesting. It's pretty cool. Hey, get a closer look. Oh. Bye. -bye. <laughs> <laughs> penguins are so silly. So where are these penguins from? These penguins are from South Africa. Okay. And we have 32 of them here at the aquarium. Wow, 32 penguins here. And these are from South Africa? Yes. <laughs> Not Antarctica? Not Antarctica. They're actually one of several species of penguins that prefer the warm climate. Oh, okay. That's pretty cool. Interesting. Warm climate and penguins. I guess you learn something every day. <laughs> okay, let's take a seat right over here. And then Hutch is gonna bring a penguin over. <laughs> I'm so excited. I get to touch a penguin. Ooh, hello. <laughs> okay, so I'm gonna touch the penguin with two fingers gently on its back. Okay, are you ready? So soft. Did you know penguins have 70 feathers per square inch? Yeah, they're really small and really dense. Can I touch the gam punch? Yes, you can. Yeah. Does that feel good? You like that? She's showing off for you. What does that mean when she shakes her head? So that means she's really happy, uh, and you might be her new boyfriend. Ooh. Ooh. <laughs> I hope she doesn't want to kiss. <laughs> oh, hello! This is a little blue penguin. It's pretty small. Whoa! And this board 
has the sizes of different penguins. Oh, like the penguin I met today, an African penguin. Whoa, and they just keep getting bigger. Whoa, whoa, look how big they're getting. Whoa, look at how big this penguin is. Whoa, four feet tall, 1.3 meters high? Jeez, look how big it is. Oh, whoa, that's a really big penguin. Do you see its beak? <laughs> kind of looks like the shape of a banana. A really colorful banana. <laughs> There's another bird over here, come on. Whoa, hello. <laughs> a colorful parrot. Hey, how are you? <laughs> Whoa, looks like it's yellow, blue, and on its head is green. <laughs> hey! Hey, there's another animal right over here I want to show you. Come on! Whoa, look! Look at this animal! It's moving really slow. <laughs> Do you know what animal this is? Yeah, this is a sloth. Let's act like a sloth together. Uh, no! How are you? Ah! 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 <laughs> That's funny. All right, hello. These are otters, and they're so cute. Look at them go underwater. Whoa. I bet they can hold their breath for a really long time. Whoa. They're so fast. Whoa. <laughs> they kind of look like water cats, <laughs> but they're not kitty cats. <laughs> Whoa. Hi. <laughs> Hello. <laughs> oh, another one. Whoa! <laughs> cool! Whoa! That was so much fun learning about all these creatures at Odyssey in Scottsdale, Arizona with you. Well, this is the end of this video, but if you want to watch more of my videos, all you have to do is search for my name. Will you spell my name with me? Ready? B-L-I-P-P-I. -P -P -I. Blippi, good job. All right, see you soon. <laughs>「If your child loves my videos, you can head to blippy.com for some super duper duper cool things. » Did you enjoy visiting the aquarium? I hope so. I hope Blippi showed you all of the amazing sea creatures that live at the aquarium. Your first job is to have a think about your trip to the aquarium. I want to know what did you see? You can write down the creatures that you saw or you can draw them or both. See if you can fill all of the space with the amazing creatures that you saw. For day two, I want to know what you thought about your tour of the aquarium. I want to know what your favourite part was and why. What did Blippi show you that you were amazed by? I also want to know what didn't you like about the aquarium? What part did you think, uh-oh, this part is not for me? Have a think about why you might not have liked that as much. See if you can write down your answers. For day three, I want you to think about your very favourite sea creature that you saw at the aquarium. 
I'd like you to draw a picture of it and why it was your favourite. Did you like the look of it? Did you think it was cute? Did you think it was big? Did you think it was small? What did you like about that creature that made it your very favourite? See if you can write down your answer. For day four, I'd like you to come up with a sea creature fact file. It does not have to be the same creature that you chose as your favourite, but it has to live in the sea. I want a picture of your sea creature. I want to know what it eats. What part of the sea does it live in? Does it live in coral reefs? Does it live at the bottom of the sea? Does it live where it is very cold or very warm? And I want to know one special fact about your sea creature. And for your very last literacy lesson, I want to finish off with an I can see challenge. What can you see under the sea? There is an example to help you, but I know you can come up with something much better. I have added keywords the and I to help you. For example, you could write, I can see an octopus swimming. I can see two clownfish. I can see a great big shark. See if you can write a new sentence on every line. Well done for all of your hard work in reception. I am so impressed with your reading and your writing. Well done for everything you have done this year. I am so proud. I will see you very soon. Have a wonderful summer. Bye bye.